from the sky Fearless men who jump and die Men who mean just what they say The brave men of the Green Beret Silver wings upon their chest these are men. Yes, the board. If you were to see the crowd without the Apaches, go ahead and you can go on the ground here, man. Afghan President Hamid Karzai said this morning 31 U.S. Special Forces and seven Afghan soldiers were killed in one of the deadliest single attacks for American troops in nearly 10 years of war in Afghanistan. Afghan officials say a NATO Chinook helicopter crashed during an anti-Taliban mission overnight in a region west of Kabul. The Taliban says its fighter shot down the helicopter with a rocket-propelled grenade. Sources tell CBS News the Chinook was carrying U.S. and Afghan forces in the Wardak region during an operation against a suspected Taliban compound that started shortly after midnight. The chopper was struck and crashed into the valley. President Karzai sent his condolences to President Obama for victims of the crash. Now, the deadly attack comes amid rising violence in Afghanistan and happened in the Tanji Valley, a region known for its Taliban activity. Nighttime strikes are one of the most successful ways U.S. Special Forces had to target Taliban hideouts. They're also one of the riskiest. Her green beret has met his fate. He has died for those oppressed, leaving her this last request. Put silver wings on my son's chest. Make him one of America's best. He'll be a man they'll test one day. Have him win 